singed and dyed my hair because after bleaching it so many times, this side was white and this side was still kind of ready orange and I wanted to see what the dye would look like and so I dyed just the tip of this blue and just the tip of this red and everybody's like, oh, Harley Quinn, Harley and I was like, no, because I don't actually like Harley and I don't like the um, comparison to her and I was like, fuck it. Logan, let me just bleach the whole thing again, or I'm going to have to dye it one or the other. And he chose to just have me dye it because he says that if I bleach it again, I'll probably lose my hair to bleach the blue and the red out and then try to lighten this. He's like, just dye it, just dye it. So I was like, okay. So this is what I've decided to do. As you can see, I've got red on one side and I've got blue on the other side. And I don't know why I decided this, probably because I want the vibrant colors, so... It's most of a bottle of this, which is, this is Blue Lagoon, as you can see, there's, I've used about half, there's actually a little bit less than half in here, and then I used, um, this one, Cherry Tastic, and there's, quit looking, you weirdo, um, there's a lot more left in this, because as Dorian says, I have more blue than red, because I've parted it so that my bangs go like they're supposed to. And I've got enough left for a touch-up, and it is very vibrant and cool looking so far. I don't know how it's going to look when it's dry, but I think it's going to look pretty cool because I don't think anybody else has hair this color that I've seen. I've looked online for red and blue, half and half, and I couldn't find any. So I'm quite happy with it so far. And I'm going to leave this on for about five hours or so. Daria! And then... Uh... It stopped recording. I turned it to you and it stopped recording. What the fuck? Anyway, I'm going to leave it on for like five hours or so. Then I'm going to wash it off and dry it and then put some... I got some of this uh, stuff. This stuff. Extraordinary oil. This cost me like 11 bucks. But it's a nourishing mask. And so I'm hoping that that will help my hair a little bit. I know the dye will help a little because dyes have all this nourishing conditioning shit in it nowadays and um so yeah so i'll check back when that's done and this will be quite exciting all right it's the next morning and i slept in my hair dye so i'm all rinsed off now it's not dried yet i'm not using a hair dryer because i don't want to frizz myself but um see if you can see in the back i did a pretty awesome job with a half and half thing i think i did it really well Sorry, I got my kitty cat jammies on. <laughs> but um, I'll go out to the hallway in a second so you can see it better on that light. But um, yeah, it's, uh, it's actually not patchy from what I can see in person. That looks a little patchy. But amazingly, when I rinsed it out, my um, the dye, like, there was like no dye in the bathtub. My hair just, it just sucked up everything. It must be like extremely porous right now from all the bleaching, which is fine by me because it's just held on to that, that dye. And um, it actually feels a lot healthier and better than it was feeling last night. Yesterday before I dyed it, it was just frizz. And I'm really depressed about getting rid of the blonde. I'm, I'm more upset than I thought I would be and just looking in the mirror and I'm like, oh, I just want that blonde back because I actually really liked that. So I don't know. I don't remember what I said in my other video, um, but I'm just going to like use up the rest of the, the hair dye that I have of this and then let my hair kind of relax a little and then I'm going to bleach it and then I'm going to try to dye it blonde so it's actually one uniform color and stay blonde for a couple of months at least. So let's go look at my mirror. Logan's asleep. It's like 4 a.m. So... There. I think that's going to look quite cool when I have makeup and contacts on and my hair is all dried and straight and stuff. I haven't had red in my hair since maybe 2002. This has been quite a while and of course 
until recently I've never had full color of my hair. It's always been black with maybe some stripes or streaks of stuff. So I like just got out of the shower and I just wanted to do this part before it's dry and then I'll make another video when it is dry and then update and then maybe put some makeup on and see how that goes. But I'm crazy happy with how evenly I did it. <laughs> and um, having it be so bleached and light has really affected the color more than anything I've ever seen. It just gets better and better each time I do this, which is fucking awesome because I've waited so long to have colored hair and now I can finally do it myself and make it look really good. Um, I feel like the sky's the limit and I could do any color that I want as long as I have the patience to try to separate my hair and do stuff, which I kind of don't. So um, I'm just like half and half is easy because then when you go to touch it up, you don't have to like lift and separate. You just half and then half and I'm lazy like that. So I do half and half. And this is the first time I haven't had any black in my hair. I think that's what's weirding me out. I've got no black in my hair right now. And um, I don't quite know if I like the color choice I made. I was told to get red instead of blue or purple because purple and blue are too, or purple and green are too close to blue. And if I wanted something really different, I should get red. And because I wear red lips, I thought, you know, blue contacts, the blue hair is good on my complexion and then red for my red lips. Uh, I was told that that would probably look good. So I figured, fuck it. I'm not a pink girl, so I'm not going to get pink. And I do want something that's quite different from the other side. So it's not like, oh, it's just one color. I want it to be like, whoa, those are two colors. And so I thought red was a good choice. But again, I'm still, maybe because I'm mourning the blonde, but I'm still not feeling this color combination yet. And then everybody keeps, Harley, Harley. And I don't like her. I don't like the, oh, the comparison to her. And when I showed that I had just dyed the whole side and the whole side, the comparisons went through the roof and it's like, oh my God, please no. But I know that they don't mean any harm by it. So I just leave it and I will catch up with you guys in a couple of hours.